Hello everybody and welcome back to another weekly replay with me hijack and this is the Skoda T50 on the map Paris now I really really dislike this map but I think I played okay on this particular match so we're gonna take a look at this and don't forget I do stream on twitch every Tuesday and Thursday 8 p.m. mountain time link to my twitch channel it will be in the video description so this video I am gonna do um, not my normal commentary but I'm also gonna count off I do make several mistakes in this match and it is uh, I'm gonna try and highlight those mistakes and if you guys think I did more mistakes please make a comment in the video you know just down below in this video and definitely point those out to me but we're gonna throw up a uh, mistake counter here just give me a second to do that and then we will begin showing you. So on Paris, I went up to this bush here to try and spot anybody crossing or help spot anybody crossing or if anybody was spotted crossing that center bit there, we would get some shots on them. But unfortunately, nobody was spotted. So I'm going to come down here to this ramp part and here comes my first mistake right here. And you'll see the mistake counter is going up. There we go. I get spotted crossing that open spot of the field and this costs me 594 four hit points. Ouch. That is definitely a costly mistake. So there's a quarter of my health, maybe more than, a, probably more like a third of my health gone in one hit right there. So that sucked a lot. So we've got mistake number one. So let's go see mistake number two, which will be coming up here shortly. So I'm repositioning on the map more towards where the heavies are because the field is kind of when I was playing this um, I felt the field was a little bit overcrowded with uh, friendly tanks so I decided to go help the heavies which actually turned out to be a good decision uh, you'll see later on in the match but overall um, it starts off not too bad I got spotted there crossing the road but nobody shot me so I was okay with that and I poke this corner and here's mistake number two I shot a dead tank, a friendly dead tank nonetheless, which I YOLO'd in there and thought it was an enemy tank, so I fired a wasted shell, but I did manage to get two shots into that M103, or no, sorry, that was a T57, T54, you want, sorry, my bad, and then he died, and then the mistake number three, I hung around and poked while I was still reloading and managed to get shot by an enemy tank, so there we go, so now I am loading a full clip once again, and I'm just thinking about repositioning here. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where should I go? And I think about poking that corner again, but I'm going to do it reverse side scraping style, thinking I can get a shot right by that little rubble pile in the wood. That's there. You can see the wood gets knocked down. And I put a shot into the leopard, or sorry, the standard B, and I get shot twice by him, and I put two into him and takes him down, and then I get shot a third time. And there we go. So that is mistake number four. Hanging around trying to empty my clip when I shouldn't have. So that's lowered me down to 85 hit points at this, at this moment. So 85 hit points now. I am down. I'm not sorry. I'm not down 85 hit points. I am down to 85 hit points. So basically, I'm a major one shot for anybody. I basically have no hit points left. So... I have to play super, super careful. I managed to put two shots into, the, into that M103. And I have one left in the clip, so I'm trying to get a nice angle on that STRV over there, but I don't manage to, so I decide to go for the reload at this point. And let us see what else we can do. So I'm reloading, trying to get into a better position, staying in cover because there is SPGs in play. Last thing I want to do is get splashed. Uh, even a... a, a decently bad miss would kill me so I want to be careful with what I've got for hit points at this point so I'm trying to craft an angle on that STRV over there on the uh, K3 area this is a patch 1.9 so it is fairly old they don't have the new markers in place STRV gets spotted I get a nice side angle I put one two two second one bounces and I put a third one into him I don't know if that hit or not but in any case, it was okay. I didn't get spotted, so I'm decently happy with the results there. Okay. Now we get to play with uh, SU-130 PM. I'm going to fully load. He's not spotting me. I put one shot into him. Put two shots. 
Spotter timer goes off. He turns his turret, but it's too late for him, and he gets taken out of the match. Up to 2,887 damage at this point. The SGV gets spotted once again. I'm trying to get an angle on his side because I can't pen him from the front due to his uh, front sloping angle of his armor. But I'm also not reloaded, so it really doesn't matter at this point. He's retreating. I put one shot into him, and I don't get the second shot, but that's okay. I'm not worried about that. I still have two in the clip. Time to reposition. The field, as you can see on the map, has won decently well. And then there's the... Uh, STRV, I get another shot into him, and I track him for the final shell in that clip. And we're just going to try and see, waiting for the reload. I get a nice angle on his front track again, but unfortunately I don't have any shots because I'm not loaded. And he now dies. So the final tank is an Udez 03. We're going to finish reloading and see if we can't get some more final shots in, in there. We get one in this front, two on his lower plate. And third for the kill. And at the end of that all, we managed to get our Mastery Badge second class only, but we did manage my first mark of excellence on the Skoda T50, as well as Fire for Effect and High Caliber for the surprising amount of 4,185 base damage and, of course, 589 assist for a grand total of 4,774 combined. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a like and thumbs up down, in, down below the video. And if you did notice any more mistakes that I may have made, please leave them in a comment down below. I, re I, re I stream on Twitch every Tuesday and Thursday at 8 p.m. Mountain Time. So don't forget to check the link in the video description. And I hope to see you guys again on the next one. Take care.